The month of February is all about heart health. Today we're going to show you how you can build a heart healthy diet. Here to show you how you can eat healthy foods packed with flavor is Bethany Frazier, who is a dietitian with Price Shopper. Good morning to you. How are Good you? Morning. Good morning, I'm Bethany. Good. I'm happy to be here to talk about heart health. So, okay, let's talk about some easy ways for people to work heart healthy foods into their daily menu plan. Yes, yeah, so what we're going to make today is super easy and that's super simple ingredients. We're making a roasted beet salad. Yum. Red foods like beets, pomegranates, berries, all are rich in what's called polyphenols, uh -huh. which are cardioprotective, so they help prevent, you, uh, prevent heart disease. So it's an easy way to sneak in a little bit more nutrition and it's super delicious too. I bet. It does smell I can't wait to try really, it. really good. So tell us why fiber is important and how people can also get more of that in their meals. Mm -hmm. So fiber, most of us get around 10 grams of fiber per day, mm -hmm. especially if you're looking to lower cholesterol, we want to focus on fiber. Fiber has to come from a carb source. So that's why in a salad like this, we want to make sure we're adding a fruit where we traditionally might add greens. Um, we add a fruit, which adds a little bit of extra fiber. Mm -hmm. Interesting. So what's a myth people have about eating heart healthy foods? Well, of course that it's gross, <laughs> <laughs> maybe bland or not very sweet. Sure. So one of the ways that we can sweeten up this recipe is by adding honey. Honey in a couple studies has shown because of its antioxidants mm -hmm. that it actually can help protect our hearts as well. Interesting. Yep. So to make this recipe, one of the tricks, because I feel like a lot of people get intimidated by beets. Yes. Okay. So definitely. one of the tricks with this to roast a beet is you just rub it in olive oil, put it in the oven, wrap it in foil for about 40 minutes. Okay. And then after it's out of the oven and cool to touch, you can peel a beet by oh. just taking a paper towel and then you just rub the skin literally right off of it. Oh. So it's so easy. Of course, it's not super unmessy, but sure, it's sure. still so easy. And then you just chop it up. You put it into your salad like this. You can add your oranges. And this, we added ricotta cheese. You could also add something like feta or goat cheese. And then we season it with some rosemary. One of the quick tips for adding rosemary or any herbs that are like this go against the um, okay. the way that the, the leaves are going. Yeah. Okay. And then you just slide against it and right into it. Yep. Oh, wow. Oh, See, that was so easy. easy. That is yep. easy. Very easy. All right. So what will we do next? So you can add the oranges in. All right. Adding the oranges. In we go. That's right. That looks so good already. A little extra fiber already. And then the ricotta cheese. All right. Pour it all in. Pour it all in. Yes. Of course. We love cheese. Yeah. And then we just mix it. <laughs> you mix it and then you can drizzle it with honey. Okay. Mix, mix, mix. All right. <laughs> I'm so, so I'm excited. <laughs> it smells so good. That rosemary, oh my gosh. <laughs> Looks good already. Rosemary is one of my favorites. I don't know what it is about the cheese and beets. Mm -hmm. Like, it just, mm -hmm. it just is a great combination. It is. All yes. right. And it drizzle some honey. Yes. Now, I will say, yours looks much better prettier, much more pretty than mine. Yeah. It's all the practice. It's all in the practice. <laughs> all right. There goes the honey. And honey's great to add to other things like your tea or your yogurt or your oatmeal if you're still looking for more ways to incorporate more heart healthy ingredients. I have my fork and I'm ready to try. Okay, let's go for it. All right, Come Adriana. On. I'm giving you this one. Thank Which you. Which one do you want to try? It's more pretty. Ooh la la. Okay. I need to get a beat. Tasty? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Your heart's healthier already. <laughs> All right. Now, Bethany, what are some easy ways to work uh, berries and other red foods into your diet? So I think it's super simple to add, again, to things like salads, mm -hmm. yogurts, oatmeals, things that you're already eating. Just always when you're approaching a meal, think of how can I add a plant to this meal? All right. Well, where can people go for more recipes? Mm -hmm. More red foods recipes, you can just go to mypricechopper.com. Awesome. Fun. Well, Bethany, thank you for joining thank us this so morning. Thank you so much. Yeah. So good. I think it's a 10 out of 10, Adriana. Highly recommend. <laughs> Highly recommend. All right. To see these recipes again, visit mypricechopper.com and tune in every Wednesday as we bring you a new recipe in our Price Chopper kitchen.